Hey, I am back because I forgot I needed to make a comment on one more part of the show, The Sisterhood, and that was the pastor's keep it real talk with his daughter. Yes, he had the sex talk with his daughters. Hmm. All right, they bring out these blue-looking um things, and they said they were wine coolers or something. I don't know if they were or if they weren't, but, yeah. Mm. I'm going to need my pastor not to be drinking wine coolers. Okay, some feel a certain way. I'm saying the fact. Okay, so we're moving on from that point. Um, so he tells the girls, listen, I want y'all to be saved and wait till you're married, but uh, let's go on and get to the real. Um, I got some condoms, and I'm going to show y'all how to put these condoms on, and I don't want y'all to experience complications, so I want you to know how to inspect body parts for different things, and I want you to put this condom on, and this is how you do it, and And I'm, I, okay, okay, number one, I applaud the pastor for having the talk with his daughters. I really do. Both he and his wife sat down and talked to his daughters, beautiful girls, coming to that time in their life. Okay, I applaud them. So they get an A for that. Okay, I applaud him for saying I want y'all to be saved. Um, But it's like he rushed past the save part and got right on into the, but I know we're going to just keep it real and just in case y'all going to do it anyway. Let me show you how to do this. Mm. And that's what I would have liked to see him encourage them a little bit more to do it God's way instead of just rushing past that into, well, let me just show you how to put on a condom or how to make sure your your, your boyfriend or whatever has a condom on. You know, I don't like that. I, I wish he would have taken more time to talk about purity and the value of you know, living a pure life. I really wish you would take a little bit more time. I do understand that teens are going to make choices for themselves. But I would just would have wished you would have encouraged them a little bit more, you know, to be pure and not just rush past that and say, well, since y'all probably going to do it anyway, let me show you how to make sure the condom is on right. Yeah. Yeah. Then he went into, like, details about how he had STDs and stuff, which was okay. I guess maybe he was trying to just keep it real and scare them into reality. But, again, my, my whole two cents is I just wish he would have spent a little bit more time. And, hey, it might have been something done with editing again with the show's producers. I do not know. But I just wish he would have encouraged purity a little bit more, you know, than just rushing past that to... You know, the Bible says don't do it till you're married. But since y'all gonna probably do it anyway, let me show you how to put it on. It's like, mm, yeah. So anyway, okay, now I'm done. Enjoy Jesus and knowledge, joy, thanks for making ministry possible. Type your comments below.